Good afternoon, everyone. Jonathan Davis here with Davis Auto Sports. Excited to offer you guys, as you'll see in this video, a absolutely gorgeous and nearly 100% flawless 2007 Freightliner Sport Chassis M2. This truck is in absolutely gorgeous condition inside and out, drivability. I'm the owner of Davis Auto Sports. Uh, I've put probably about 500 miles on this truck, both empty and pretty loaded up drives phenomenal every single thing works perfectly in this truck i had the opportunity to speak with and be with the previous owner for about three hours uh, on his property one day and uh, he had a, a great appreciation for the truck uh, this was a indoor stored truck as well the owner spent a lot of time upkeeping this truck both cosmetically and mechanically just recently had six tires installed a full allison approved fluid transmission service all new fluid that service by itself is a major service due to the cost of the allison fluid full ac service as well this thing is 100 percent turnkey ready to go have all the books service records he kept the wheels very nice. He didn't have the ability to cut and polish them. He was an older gentleman, used it for a two horse enclosed trailer. So the only thing that we really, we didn't have to do, which is we love these trucks. They're gorgeous trucks when they look 100%. So we went ahead and cut and polished the wheels, have about four hours into each wheel. And you'll see when we do some close ups, they look absolutely beautiful. They do look like chrome, although obviously they are aluminum. One thing you'll note on the front of this Freightliner are the headlights, no oxidation, no condensation. They look absolutely beautiful. Upgraded bulbs inside as well. That is a hella high-end headlight. It's not the cheap ones that you can get online. Color match grill, they offer this in chrome. I think with the color match, it looks really, really clean. It looks more sporty in my opinion. The paint on this truck is absolutely gorgeous throughout. The wheel has an absolutely beautiful reflection. There's no oxidation. Beautiful, beautiful finish. I'll show you all the tread on all the tires here shortly, but as I mentioned, those have recently been replaced. But just take a look at the body on this truck. Garage cap. The only thing on all of these trucks, and it's not just this one, I've owned and sold probably 15, 20 of these trucks. The only wear and tear on this entire truck is just a common spot right there from where you step. That's just because if your shoe has a little bit of dirt on it, it's going to hit that painted part right there. So that's really the, and there's nothing you can do. This is just how they come. Um, if I was to own one of these, I personally would do a rock guard down to here or even all the way down. That way that doesn't happen or clear coat it or uh, clear film it, excuse me but that is literally the only wear on this entire truck. It's that nice of a truck. Just an absolutely gorgeous rig right here. Drives just as it looks. As you note too, one of the sporty little upgrades, instead of having the amber bulbs, they're clear, although they illuminate in amber, so they're completely legal. Uh, the clear lenses just give it a, a more sporty look, if you will. Same thing with the fender lens as well. They did keep the amber roof lights up there. But if you look at this paint, how soft and smooth it is. He did a phenomenal job up keeping this. We also did our full polish on it as well. Bed's in beautiful condition.
Nice cut and polish wheel. Very deep tread in these tires. Like I said, just recently replaced. Also, let me be very clear. This is a pre-diff truck, um, which is the one that you want. No regen, no diff fluid. So, and this does have the Mercedes 330 engine, which is, in my opinion, it's it's my favorite engine out of the Mercedes, uh, the Cat C7, and the Cummins. This, to me, is is my favorite. Um, I've owned a number of the Mercedes ones and. They just feel more peppy and more power, and I've never had one single issue with those. We'll go ahead and let me show you this uh, storage first. Also take a note, when you're looking at these other trucks online, you'll see a lot of these are faded from sitting outside and everything else. Light does work in there. You got your air hose. Uh, with the reel, obviously, and your battery charger as well. Just a small, regular storage in there. We'll go ahead and... So back here, you have upgraded LED lights on their own switch. They are on a swivel, so you can angle them however you want. Check out the roof. Extremely clean. Paint up here is in phenomenal condition. Just a great looking rig. Massive box right here with the matting. We do have the locks for that as well. Struts work, obviously. Got a lot of pressure on those. You have your rail system on both sides in the middle, and we do have all the hardware for those as well. Obviously, you guys know, fully adjustable. We have probably about 10 to 15 of these. Gooseneck, fifth wheel ball. look chrome came out absolutely beautiful a very very tedious process nothing worse than seeing one of these trucks with oxidized aluminum wheels they almost look sort of like a silver white sometimes so as I was speaking on earlier the previous owner was just real big on keeping this thing clean and he's the second owner when he bought it he called sport chassis and got, um, these are sport chassis seat covers. Um, they were on it when I bought it, but I obviously wanted to show you guys the condition of the seats, but these do have sport chassis embroidery on it. So full seat covers, which are real nice if you're gonna be getting in and out dirty, which is good for some of you guys. Once again, super deep tread on the tires. Even wear all the way around on them. Look at that paint shine in the sun. Just a beautiful, beautiful truck.
gorgeous interior. We'll start off here in the back. Floor mats, phenomenal condition underneath the mats. Very, very clean. I mean, this thing just shows absolutely perfect. Back seat folds down, works exactly as it should. All the lighting works. The mood lighting up there works as well. You got all your plugins right there for your rear monitor. All your books and manuals and receipts and everything that have been kept. Um, you have down in there a nice flush mount dual amps and subwoofer down there. If you guys can see on that back wall, it's flush mount, two amps in there. Done very well. Everything's super clean. No odors, non-smoker. Show you this side of the seat as well. That's just from the book being in there. You got all sorts of, I mean, you got your full build and spec sheet still in the plastic. I mean, every, this is the type of owner he was. Um, just kept everything absolutely perfect. So we also, as, as I mentioned, do have the service records as well. Check out how clean this thing and all the seals are in great condition. Wood grains, very clean. Usually these speaker grills pop out and as you see, they're perfect there. No issues. Upgraded large Alpine screen. Uh, the reason it protrudes out is because the dash only allows for a small seven inch. I believe this is a 12 inch, which is really, really nice to have. Great visibility. Wood grain, super nice handle. Everything's just very, very clean. I've always loved these trucks in silver. The white, to me, looks too much like a standard commercial truck that you see uh, any commercial company have. Uh, black, to me, gets dirty very easy. Uh, shows all the swirl marks and imperfections. So to me, silver is a color that I've always favored in this truck. Let's go ahead and pop this real quick. Go ahead and crank it up as well. So we have all sorts of keys, keys to all the locks, all the boxes, um, alarm, extra key there.
right, so here we are in the test drive portion of the video. Good, strong crank. No lights on. That's a seat belt. That's just the brake light letting you know that it's on. I'm not going to go through the whole dash. If you guys are looking at these trucks, you know what they are. But this does have the nice uh, air brake uh, for the parking brake, which is very nice. Some of these trucks don't have those, and that makes a huge difference. Uh, as touched on earlier, the large screen um, Alpine, really nice setup. Apple AirPlay, all that good stuff. Really, really nice uh, brake controller. This is on wide view. But a really, really nice unit there. You have additional USBs. This plugs in uh, to the back of this. So whatever's through this unit here, uh, being your iPhone, is going to play directly off of this. So it's a wired uh, Apple Play and also a wireless. Your Bluetooth microphone up there. Um, of course, all your mood lighting and stuff like that, as touched on earlier, all works throughout. So this is your AV selection uh, on your camera setting. We'll go ahead and push the brake in there. So what I didn't show you uh, when I was doing my video is there is a camera obviously right in front of the hitch, which makes for backing up into the hitch really, really nice. Uh, and there's your regular backup camera as well. So a uh, pretty sweet setup there. This uh, is your front fog lamps and that's gonna be um, your rear upper lamps as well and then of course your dump and then your engine brake high and low setting uh, which is really nice Allison 3200 transmission which is silky smooth in this thing So many of you guys that are looking at sport chassis may have never owned one and currently may have a uh, 350 or even a 450 or 550 if you have a Dodge or, or a Ford for that matter. Um, and one thing that if, if you were towing and you were looking at this for a tow vehicle, it's just no comparison in any way, shape or form. Um, I do a lot of towing. I usually have at least one of these in inventory. Uh, the first thing you'll notice is the amazing visibility. First, you're very high off of the ground, and then you have this huge window that just gives you the best visibility. Uh, your great mirrors as well. The stability of the truck, the braking of the truck, it's um, just no comparison to being in any. Uh, I, I've had the new 450s uh, with full Kelderman air suspension. Um, and it's just, it's a pleasure. Plus you have a huge back seat for your kids or your um, whoever's with you. So he should get over, but we'll see what he does going about 20 miles an hour go ahead and get over this is there there's no passing anywhere on this road all right guys so back back to a clear road um, so cruising here at 55 see all the gauges and everything in perfect operating temperatures and ranges and this is one thing so this road has a ton of grooves on it it's a big logging road and uh, you'll see just how perfect this truck tracks. One finger on the wheel, legs are not on the wheel whatsoever, and this thing just drives absolutely perfect. Hand off the wheel, legs off. AC blows nice and cold, heat works perfect. Cameras do work while you're in motion, which is very nice. 
this is a beautiful, beautiful truck. Our sport chassis do not last. Uh, all the ones that we sell are in phenomenal condition. I will say this is, uh, for our inventory, higher mileage than normal, but um, when I spent time with the owner, looked over the truck, it was just an absolutely no-brainer uh, to take this truck in on inventory. Just because it has 173, it truly looks like a 15, 20,000 mile truck. It is that nice. Um, so for the most part, that will end the video. I'm gonna go ahead and turn around and drive back to the office. So for drivability purpose, I will keep the camera rolling uh, just to show you how this thing drives, but there will be pretty much no more information for me blabbing my mouth. So if you guys have any questions, 855-955-3377. Thanks for viewing, and as mentioned, I will continue rolling.